A month ago, shocking video of a racist chant sung by a chapter of Sigma Alpha Epsilon fraternity sent shockwaves across our country. Many spoke out against Greek organizations and the lack of integration. But tonight, WVUA's Eric Gonzalez spoke with a fraternity with the University of Alabama who's looking to make a change. Meet Nolan Corder and Jeremiah Johnson. On the outside, they seem like two ordinary college students. But over the past year, they have become pioneers for African Americans in the Greek system. Last June, the pair of sophomores became the first African Americans to receive a bid from the Alpha Tau Omega at the University of Alabama. It's just an insurmountable feeling to know that you've left your mark in some way, you know, to know that there's something that no one will ever be able to take away from you, that you worked hard, you know, you earned it. Brothers of ATL are happy they can finally call Nolan Jeremiah their brothers. They, you know, they are a great asset to the fraternity. They bring a lot of personality to it. The only thing that's frustrating about it is that it took us this long to reach this step. Jeremiah is thankful to be part of an organization where he is judged solely on his character. Great to be a part of uh, pioneering and, and um, you know, just getting that message out about equality and, and not really focusing on, you know, skin color and whether, you know, if you meet this standard or this standard, but, you know, your character, judging your character as a person. and. Um, I think that's awesome, and that's and that's how it should be. Jeremiah has a positive outlook on the future. This is a, gr a great sign of things to come. We knew, you know, it's not gonna. It's gonna be a gradual process. Um, it's just gonna take time, you know, more time to uh, for things to come together. But it's definitely good that we're able to to start it off. It's it's a great thing. Nolan, Jeremiah, and the brothers of ATO show us that perseverance, hard work, and acceptance will get you anywhere in life. You can do anything that you set your mind to. Don't ever let someone tell you that you can't do it. You know, you just got to keep the dream alive. You got to keep on believing. You got to work hard for it. You can do anything you set your mind to. And also, I'd just like to thank all the brothers in the fraternity, you know, for, for treating us so well because we really appreciate it. And it's just one of the best feelings to know that we're loved by so many good guys, you know. So. Reporting from the University of Alabama, I'm Eric Gonzalez for WVUA News.